All right, I start out today by just uh, doing a little detail work on the uh, hind leg of the uh, warrior. And the warrior's horse that's uh, 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 in front and uh, just trying to get the uh, muscles tuned up a little bit. Uh, I finally got some reference material that I'd been missing and uh, found a power cord for my Galaxy uh, uh, oh, tab. Uh, it's kind of like a iPad, and all my reference material was on it, and I couldn't find a power cord, and so finally got one. Anyway, I uh, started out the day doing that. I didn't video much today because there were a lot of kids in the uh, gallery, and I just, I, if I can avoid it, I try to avoid putting kids' kids pictures up uh, or videos up on uh, YouTube. Uh, here I'm putting the uh, fur on the fetlocks, the uh, long hair. Uh, just dresses up the uh, bottom part of the hoof a little bit. <coughs> I've taken the warrior away and I've uh, just basically took the horse away too. Uh, I want to get the uh, leg on legs on this uh, warrior on the horse. Um, finally to that point where I can safely add him and not uh, interfere with anything that's uh, unsculpted on the uh, horse. I start out with just a tube of clay, uh, size it up and all that stuff with the uh, calipers. I'm just basically trying to figure out uh, what leg position to put it in. Um, it, it, it's it's got to, to go with the design of the piece, and uh, you know that's just the, the way. It, that's one of the things that you have to pay attention to is is uh, design and make it believable too. Just adding a foot and uh, trying to get it sketched in. I'm going to probably put leggings on this warrior. <coughs> now, whether I put fringe on the uh, leather leggings or uh, a flap on the uh, tra on a trade cloth legging, I'm not certain yet. Uh, here I'm getting the other leg. I've got it up higher because I've got the other horse that sits up next to that horse. And I don't know how it's going to interfere with the uh, leg, and so I'm putting it up high. Not really liking it up that high at all. I was in the gallery about seven hours today. It was a beautiful day outside. Uh, late in the afternoon, uh, the smoke from the Yosemite fires started uh, coming in on the lake, but uh, more or less about 10 miles south of uh, where I am here. And so the, the lake was just beautiful today, and the sky was blue, and we haven't really had that for a while. That's what I usually do, I'm looking for a tool. <laughs> I'm just filling in his thigh here. It had a bit of a dent in it. I apologize for the lack of good camera angles, but uh, nothing I can do about it. Uh, I'm adding the uh, other horse and uh, Indian to the piece uh, just to see if I can move that leg down or 
how close uh, it is to the other horse. And I'm lining up the board right now so I can get it to exactly where it's supposed to be. This is an artist uh, friend who's uh, selling a poster right now outside uh, the gallery. Uh, that's his daughter and, and her boyfriend. All right, I take the uh, Indian and the horse away uh, because now I got the uh, leg uh, positioned where it's not interfered, being interfered by the other horse. That's going to be it for today. Uh, I will be back in the gallery tomorrow, and we'll see how much I get done tomorrow. Have a great night, everybody, and happy uh, Labor Day if you don't uh, see me tomorrow. Yeah, I'm looking at my watch. <laughs> Sue me. <laughs>